In this video, we are going to learn about TCP connection establishment. TCP stands for Transmission Control Protocol. Connections in the TCP are full duplex. Connections are established using a three way handshake. Host 2 executes the listen primitive at first. Then, host 1 executes the connector primitive. It specifies the IP address and port, maximum TP, TCP segment size, and user data which is optional. Sends a TCP segment with a SIN bit on and an acknowledgement bit off. Segment arrives at the destination and checks for a process that has done listen on the destination port. If a process is listening to the port, the process receives the TCP segment. If it accepts the connection, an acknowledgement segment is sent back from host 2 to host 1. Connection is established once host1 responds with an acknowledgement segment to host2. So this is the general architecture of how the connection will be established in a normal way, normal case and the, how the connection will establish on both the sides simultaneously. Since TCP is a connection oriented protocol and every connection oriented protocol needs to establish connection in order to resolve resources on both the communication ends. The connection establishment. Sender starts the process with the following. A sequence number. Contains the random initial sequence number which generated at the sender side. Here the host side. And a SYN flag. Request receiver to synchronize its sequence number with the above provided sequence number. And it also has a maximum segment size. Sender tells its, its maximum segment size so that receiver sends datagram which won't require any fragmentation. MSS field is present inside option field in the TCP header. The window size. Sender tells about his buffer capacity in which he has to store messages from receiver. So first the host 1 will send a scene request to the host 2. The host 2 will re respond with an scene and an acknowledgement telling to the host 1 that it has received the request of host 1. Then host 1 will respond with a, sequ with a sequence number and an, and an acknowledgement. So here the connection will be established. So that's why it is called as a three way handshake protocol because there are three ways to like total of three steps to establish the connection here. The one, two, three. So this is the simultaneous connection establishment of TCP on both the sides. Thank you.